Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev. Welcome back to this Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2 as Bengal. Look through the tech options. There weren't any, so <laughs> that was easy enough, I suppose. Anyway, we're going to continue sieging this stuff down. Let's try to get, kick the other guy out of the occupational areas. And uh, try to enforce. Because I don't think we can push for this unless uh, the other fella doesn't hold anything. Again with the tower. Good lord, this is going to bankrupt us. 2,000 gold and rising fast. Even more than that. Anyway, the Great Tower that you began planning so long ago has finally been finished already. Okay. A tower this tall can be seen from a very long way away. And people are equally amazed and frightened by the power you have displayed by, um, by accomplishing such a grand fe feat of construction. Okay. During the years of work you have uh, spent spent your time uh, perfecting your knowledge in the uh, many key aspects of the science of construction knowledge. That will... knowledge that will last centuries. Okay, the tower is... Also, sure to hold hold back many thousands of enemy soldiers. So we can get the architect trait. Ooh. That is rather sweet. <laughs> uh... Can gain more prestige. Oh, I would re replace my trader perk for this. Um. Trader is two to plus two. So here we'll get some extra marshal and some siege. And other architects would be fond of us more, but uh, I don't know. So it's basically plus one. We trade uh, 150 prestige for plus one marshal. And siege ability. You know what? I'll, I'll think we'll go with that. It's okay. Wait, was that a trait up here? Oh! Oh dear. I might have screwed myself then. I thought it was a trait here. I got something up there. Okay, fair enough. It's over at least. No more bottomless... Bottomless thing there. Still need to siege one more. Okay. Uh. Not sure what's going on there, but uh, that's interesting enough. Suppose. Uh. So who are you, and are you actually sieging down that stuff? I don't think so. Are you some kind of host? Hostile to me. Oh, did you finish that war? Wait, 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 wait. Wait. 
Okay, you took over. That's how this war ended. Fine. Um... That's kind of unfortunate. You still hold the kingdom now. Still, which are your personal holdings? I should probably go and check that. That's uh, this one. Yeah, we already hold it. Wait. Oh yeah, the duchy. Uh, that's fine then. Yeah, let's go up and smash these armies and then take that Kandachi and go downwards. I think it's safe to say we're gonna win this, but... Um Gonna, not gonna sacrifice myself for you. Uh, just a random courtier. No, no, no. Anyway, uh, but I, I can probably reset you to somewhere else. So you're gonna convert. Should probably check to see which one is the largest one. I honestly don't know what affects the conversion chances. If a larger uh, or a large, larger county will take more effort to convert, I don't know. But yeah, sure, go there, convert whatever you can. It's fine. And now, as for our uh, devotion, we want to raise that again, so. Let's see, donate to charity, you do have enough money now. <laughs> sort of. It's 100 devotion, so I'll take it. Uh, invite Holy Ascetic. No real option I care about. No need to shut the gates yet either. Wait, did we actually capture her? We caught her! Ha! Huh. Quartered in battle. That's um, that's lucky. So what'll actually happen now? <laughs> Wait. The unfaithful. Ah. Uh. Oh well, uh, but anyway, we're gonna claim this. Yeah, she uh, took, uh, she actually took the throne, but that's fine. Uh, but um, hopefully, I didn't think about this. Hopefully, she'll still appoint him as the heir. The curious thing is, we are an empire, and she holds a kingdom title. So why isn't she a vassal? Oh, 
now I have the slight problem of regencies. Uh, um, I need someone who's loyal. That's one thing. And I need someone who's skilled. That's the other thing. I wish there was a way to see the total number of points. I don't really want to have anyone who's a, as a claimant either. <laughs> um, okay, sort by rank then. Should my son be up here somewhere? There you are. Well, he does still kind of like me. Wait, 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 wait. That's not the right son. Um. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Yeah, you don't like me, my dear heir. And I think making you my regent could be rather bad. Who's going to be auto-designated then, if I don't make a designation? And uh, you know what, my nephew, you're going to be the it. What's the worst that could happen? Oh. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so if you die, my rival is gonna... Oh yeah, that's fine. But if you die, I'm gonna have a new regent anyway, so that's okay. Please have kids. What do you even hold? Oh right, you're the one that lives over here, right? Yeah, that's fine. It's okay. Um... Reveal plots. That's fine. I don't think I'm too worried about that. Child next education focus. My nephew. Um, oh, you look to be quite high in learning. You are Bengali. Sure, heritage. Oh, right. We can move these guys home now. And someone died. Okay. No, son, I'm not gonna sacrifice myself for you. Sorry. I'm still too young for that. Actually, what is my age at this point? 48, so we're gonna die soon enough. Uh, group of craftsmen. Um, sure. Let's, uh, let's invest. I 
wait, we didn't gain... Um, we didn't gain threat from that. Curious. Did you fall asleep again in the prayers? Okay, we'll wake you up. I uh, think not. Nothing of it. That's fine. And now you're back. Fine. Excellent. Stand down. Okay, so... Now our dear uh, missus had quite a few more claims. subjugation instead, but I can't press her claim. That was a weak claim, wasn't it? Yes, a weak claim. Um... Yeah, I can't push that claim at all. And the last claim, the one that wants that strong. Yeah, right. I can't actually push that because she's no longer uh, my subject. She's no longer my subject. That's uh, problematic. I'll definitely form an alliance with my wife. I don't want her to lose the kingdom. Okay, so I can't do subjugation against you. Oh boy, you actually have quite a lot. Uh, can I declare a subjugation war on you? No, okay. Good on you, which kind of surprised me. If they're from the same culture group, ah, so that's the problem. You have to be of the same culture group in order to do that. So. Wait, aren't all of these in the same culture group? I'm confused now. You're in the Indo-Aryan group. And this dude over here. Mm, he's Tra yeah, that's fine. And you are Travidian. So you're both Travidians. But this, isn't, this guy's not. And that is why I can try to subjugate him. Okay, who are you and why can I claim the kingdom on your behalf?
Still, that's probably the next war. Um, he hates our guts. But he has two kingdoms. Right? Hmm. Oh, India is down here is such a mess. Okay, I'm gonna go for Detroit Kingdoms. I wanna see. Okay. Okay, I'm really confused here. That's the short part of it. Right? So that's the one you want, not this. Yeah, because that's gonna give us this. This is gonna give us that, which is not what I want. Okay, let's consider this. So, you, sir, have how many friends? That's all on aggression pact, so you are not part of any compound. Compi um, any compact against me? I don't think I have anyone anymore. We have a whole bunch of weak claims that can be pushed. They're not gonna attack our wife. And I don't think I'm quite strong enough to push against this kid, which I, I really want to attack him, but... Uh, I have a feeling if I start any sort of war... He's gonna be... Uh, Rather obnoxious. I'd love to start a few holy wars. Just to eat our way into his uh, territory, but I'm very much very afraid of what's gonna happen over here then. So I still I still wanna, you know, secure India first, then we can push up. So yeah, it's gonna be this guy. Uh well, not this guy, that that one. Provided, of course, he doesn't have a billion men. No, he's not that strong. I think you can handle that. Um, I'm also terrified of what my wife is going to do. Can she change it? Agnatic, agnatic primogenitors. So, but she can still appoint an heir because she's Buddhist. So now I kind of need my wife to die. Actually, I need her to die after me. Because if she dies first, my son is going to go and inherit this stuff. And I don't know if he's, he would... Would he be a loyal subject of mine? No, he wouldn't be. I wonder now, if, I've gi I should, if I'd given my wife a county... That's my problem. I should have given my wife a county. If I'd done that, she would still have been my vassal. Didn't think about that. Right? If she'd had a county, she would not have become independent upon getting the claim. I think. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. 
Anyway, it's gonna sort itself out. We're gonna probably gonna start the war with this guy. I think a subjugation war here isn't a bad idea. Um, of course, that's quite a few areas. That's all this. No allies, no nothing. We are gonna lose some karma. But that's quite okay. So, yeah. At war we are. And we're, of course, gonna raise our troops and all that fun stuff. Just meet up there, and we'll start marching down towards our new potential conquest. And <laughs> we'll see how that goes next time, because it is time for a break. Thank you for watching.